Welcome to Onivia, League of Legends Highlights. These are the best highlights from today's LPL matchup. It's the call. Scout's there. This time around, Scout is on Lucian, not Azir. So the, the level 6 mark, a little bit more significant. <laughs> LNG with a bit more early presence this time around. Birdle on that rumble, wants to try and contest, but he's put himself in a flanked position. And oh, the roots barely. hit. How did that hit? It's by a pixel. Locked up and taken down first blood for Zika, and suddenly that top lane don't look so bad they do need to find a way to have some separation in terms of where they're getting their leads but it is going to be a consistent focus towards bot side right now as well as uh 3v3 is a brewing munch Darla's going to try and finish off that wave moves on over Jin Zhao, the target needs to get clipped by the ult as hung has just gone in and Jin Zhao is just gone Xiao yet chased away by Hung as the rest of the team moves in. Built in Lullaby onto two here. But Meteor don't really have any follow up damage. And that locket getting big value as Gala dives in 2v1. He is feeling it today. And rightly so. One more Mystic shot flashed away. Something where they need to consistently keep the pedal to the metal. They certainly do. That's Vettel using his ultimate. Oh, faking no the recall. Zika's no. going to top side. Vettel with the genius play in the top side. Fakes the recall, finds a kill. Can we just. Once again, both LGD solo laders group up to try and do something against Scout. Wait, wait. In the brush, though. And this time the TP Last comes play. in. This time it's the numbers advantage for LNG. Vettel, the one caught out. And that'll be gifted over to Scout as well. Nice bit of a gold injection for the mid lane of LNG. I seriously don't think the phrase love him at his worst, get him at his best has ever fit somebody so well besides Bertle this series. <laughs> Incredible stuff and then straight into a bad play. And oh, now roots. LNG. Looking for another one. Jin Zhao with a really nice anchor toss, but still pulled straight back in and still take it down. Meteor in the mix of Xiaoya. It's just in the middle oh. of everyone. And hi, Jado chase out of the top side. It's a double kill for Scout. But it's zero that... now. They, it could have been a 1-1. One, one. Yeah, but it's also um, like with your ad adoration stacks, you can't afford yeah, no, to play that exactly. risky in early fights. <laughs> you just can't. Like, unless the kill is, is right there for you. It's not like anyone was it like... It just came to those big slip-ups around the later game objective fights. Uh, we are seeing that hi, Chow is going to be pounced on by Scout over here. Now. Oh. Scout uses the call in, but Jin Zhao denies any chance. Hi, Chow. Nearly went down for that one, but it is a kill on to Scout once again. A big focus from LGD on shutting Scout down. The Broccoli King is back, Hai Chao. Able to get a little bit of gold under his belt and punishing a Scout that did have a 3 and one start to this one, or at least 3-0 start to it. Oh, oh that's no. huge! Gala walks straight into it. He doesn't have cleanse. He's got barrier here. He's just gonna oh. melt. Beautiful little swill seed from Meteor. And that sets up for the Herald. I'm starting to get some rumblings. They punish LNG when they do make these mistakes because, yep. like, LGDs of the past would yeah. not yet. Like, you know, it was always going to be a hard group for LGD. The fact that they made it here at all is already, like, massive improvement. This is an organized... <laughs> pressure from LGD on this bot. Tier 1, High Chow, desperately trying to finish it. We'll be able to do so. Tanked a couple of tower shots, which weakens the potential fight. Got LGD. And Scout will be able to trade it on the opposite side of them. I feel like all series long, every single time we see LGD take a tower, Scout is somewhere taking a different tower. He's on yeah, two. I mean, he's already on two items. Didn't even have to get the brown picker bags upgraded. Oh, Jin Zhao. Well, that's a freebie for Gala. Nice little present there. <laughs> that's, uh, I mean, he'll happen happened so that many up. times. Good lane prio, because we do have that dragon coming up. Would be a second one for LNG. They are setting up plenty around this, though. TP can come in. Roots have come through, as is the Rel, the Metal Horse, setting up for Scout to take them down. The lights like it. And here comes Zika to impact the backline. Meteor gets a three-man oh. slip, though, and a chance to turn things around. Birdle dives in alongside him. Scout burns to death as well. And LGD, LGD have miraculously found their way into the fight. The charge in the middle of everything from Birdle as the tower goes down. How the hell have LGD got away with that one? What is happening on my screen right now, Munchables? LGD are pulling fights out of the brink of nothing. The fact that they get the turret, they get the kills, they're able to take a charge into the tier two there as well. And off the back of that one, they're going to take the dragon to deny the early stacking from LNG. 
Where has this LGD been? They've been struggling. They've God. been... So, like, you know, it looked like Meteor had been betrayed for a second there, but Birdle. Master of Ceremonies, it seems. Master of the moment, at very least. Uh -oh. Xiao, yeah, stunned up, rooted up. And it's another blunder from LGD's bot lane. It goes back and forth. It ebbs and it flows. And uh, Xiaoya will find a bit of a gray screen. This means LNG can start up the bear. And they have Zika around the other side, too. This will be heartbreak for LGD. If LNG can just grab Baron here. LGD looking like they want to fight, but it's 4 they haven't seen v Zika. 5 here. Help oh, no. The news. LNG. Zika comes behind the roster. They can't quite finish the kills. Jin Chao, low bird. Or diving onto the back line himself, but he doesn't have the damage. And LNG. They play it well, they hold on, but they can't get the Baron. So actually, a support on the top laner to deny Baron, I'd say it's probably worth. Oh. Just on the brink of two items there. Same for Birdall, three, three, and one. Just on the brink of two items. I feel like both of them have the picks and the power on them to potentially carry Hong something. Had Hong a flank. has found a flank. How the hell did he get there? Jin Zhao is found. And forget the top laners, I guess it's about the supports after all. We saw exactly this happen last time. They were willing to start up the Baron. Ooh, Hightower getting a decent amount of poke on Nagala there in the end, but it is a massive catch out and oh, Hawk no. finds another one! That's a bit of an <laughs> aggressive position from Hightower. Will be punished. Zika just pokes him to finish the kill, and we're two down. That's an opportunity for Baron for LNG. Well, the death does a good chunk. Birdall's in the area too. Equalizer, Equalizer can be extremely valuable in a Baron pit if Meteor can Meteor get it too. Flash. There's the Equalizer going down, but they just jump onto Meteor. He was on a ward. And LGD, one by one, being picked apart. Xiaoya trying to move in here. I don't think there's much to be done for LGD. Jin Zhao yeah. spawned on the sapling. Just vision, dominance, and punishment from it. For, LG, uh, for LNG. The first one is a fantastic play from Hung. The second one, I've got to say, I feel like I chap. <laughs> <laughs> like, object permanence, man. We know Hung is over towards Oh, our no, there he is again, much. Oh, God. Bird on now oversteps. And LGD, it feels like this last couple of minutes has broken the mental a little bit. Overstepping across the board. And LNG might just be on their way to evening up the series now. Have you ever seen Hung and Michael Myers in the same room together? Because he is just appearing behind people, even though you do not think he has the speed to catch up to them. Uh, it's looking a little bit like a horror movie now. LGD yeah. consistently finding some rough decisions. That is true, but I've also never seen you and Michael Myers in the same room. True. So I've never saying. seen you and Michael Myers. Oh, my God. We could keep this going all night. It'd be great. <laughs> the ch tier, tier two's traded here. As... Uh, I mean, in terms of gold, it's definitely all LNG right now, but LGD, at least they get something off of the back of their, uh... I can't remember who was caught out. I think it was Hanchan was caught out on the boss side. Maybe it was Birdall. I can't remember. But LNG, I just, I mean, you don't want to see it. Here we go. TP play onto Scout. It's oh just the bread and butter play at this point for LGD. The Scout just dashes away. Hanchan will be able to finish the job. So there we go. A pick for LGD. What else yeah. can they find? At the top of the playbook today, when LGD came into the coach's room in big, bold letters, they say, kill Scout. And they have done so consistently for all now. A player that this year, I feel like he's had some really big series. Oh, my God. Gala just goes 2v1 and oh, he wins it as well. Shall you down. Gala has reinforcements and Zik is not stopping anytime soon. Charges in towards the back line and sets it all up. Beautiful fighting from LNG. The game is over. Gala has had enough. The hard engage Ezreal. It didn't work in game number one. It works this time around though. It absolutely does. Him and Scout combining for a masterful game two. This is the LNG that needed to show up. There's still some big question marks to finish it off, but it's big. They even up the series. We're going to three games. My goodness. These were the best highlights from today's LPL matchup. Click that subscribe button faster than Ramus can say. Okay. See you on the next one.